Hello guys, it's Total War Master here. Thanks for stopping by, and today I'm bringing you all a little bit of a different pace, uh, change in pace uh, today. Uh, now, to those of you who watch my channel, um, those of you who have the idea that I don't necessarily stick with campaigns as much as I should, uh, that's not true. <laughs> uh, I do try to do as much as I can, but I'm just really busy when I try to get to it, and when I do get to it, I end up screwing up the, the uh, file or something like that. Um, so, today I owe you guys a lot of uh, Darth Mod episodes, and I can assure you that there will be one up on Sunday. I can not stress that enough that there will be one up on Sunday. This time I extremely promise uh, that it will be up on Sunday. Um, but today, to just to kind of make it up a little bit, I'm going to have a little bit of a campaign for another campaign uh, for Total War Shogun 2. And this one I know I can't screw up because I love the, the uh, Shogun 2 campaign. Uh, I love it a lot. Fall of the Samurai and all those. I love them. Um, so, anyway, guys, today we're going to be playing as the Takeda. Uh, we're going to play in a long campaign. Uh, Game Dota is going to be on hard. Uh, I do not want drop in battles. Um, so, anyway, uh, let's go ahead and get started here. Uh, I am pretty excited to be playing as the Takeda uh, because they are pretty much all cav based. Uh, they don't focus much on anything else other than cav. So that's awesome. Uh, <laughs> uh, so I can't wait to work with them. Uh, again, guys, I might call this, uh, depending on when it goes up, it's going to either go up on Tuesday or Wednesday. So it will either be called Total War uh, Shogun to uh, Tuesday or Total War Shogun Wednesday uh, campaign. So, um, uh, so just go ahead and look out for that. Uh, I just don't know when it will go up. So either Tuesday or Sunday. If not Tuesday, then Wednesday will definitely be the day when it's up. So uh, let's go ahead and watch this. 15 or 45. This is Sengoku Jidai, the age of the country at war. For 200 years, the Ashikaga shoguns have ruled from Kyoto. Great splendor and power were theirs. Now the overmighty clans no longer obey. The time has come for a new warlord to become Shogun. But who will be victorious? Takeda lands have always provided for our people. Our enemies are many and envious. They threaten our borders and look for any weakness. To be Takeda is to be born in the saddle. We are master horsemen. Our cavalry astounds all. Let others march. We ride. We fly. Like storms in the mountains, we thunder in battle. Bisha Mountain, the war god, has woken. Now is the time to defeat our enemies! All will bow to the Takeda clan. We wait no longer! Destiny calls! We are the Takeda. All right. So, let's go ahead and uh, skip that. I don't want to waste too much time. Uh, so, the uh, Shilano Warlords, or once we may have considered the uh, American allies. Um, our prosperity and might has led to conflict between us and the Shilano. Defeat an army belonging to the following clan, Murakami. And then we can get Dreaded Force, which instills fear in enemy units for four seasons. Uh, for, uh, I don't know, that's seasons remaining. So, be quiet, lady. Alright, so let's go ahead and get a feel for what we're going to be dealing with here. 
Uh, so we're pretty much kind of squished here between clans all around us at the moment. Um, so we are making a fair amount of income. Our clan treasury is okay. Um, let's go ahead and take a look at what we're going to be doing with rice patties and improved irrigation. I'll put in some on improved irrigation because we need the food. Food is pretty essential <laughs> in this campaign. So uh, roads, we'll need roads too. Um, now since these guys are pretty cab based, uh, when I do our arts, I am going to be doing Bashudo first uh, and trying to get our cav uh, area upgraded all the our cav in before anything else. So I need to find something that deals with cav. Uh, fire bomb. Uh, we have the bow. We have the sea. We have the spear. We have the earth. We have the sword. One. Enable swooping crane running speed for all units in battle. I think this might be the one that we're looking for. Great guard. So yeah, that's about good. I want to get at least a good cav unit out of it. So we'll start at Bashudo and then we'll go down gradually. And then once we get to this. Um, I might just keep on going down to horse mastery. If not, then I'll might go around and start researching other things. Um, but um, we need to get Takeda in this army here. Ooh, this is a pretty small army. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, but let's look at this army real quick. Um, yeah, I think we might be able to take this army. So. And they're running for me. Cowards. Come back and fight. So. I'm going to go ahead and fight them. So. <coughs> now, normally this is the one... This is the game that has uh, the speeches that they make before they go into battle. I don't personally like to go watch the speeches, only if I think they're kind of good. It's like medieval. They're good and they're bad sometimes. Um, I'm going to just skip them uh, for this campaign. If you guys don't want me to skip them, then just go ahead and put down in the comments saying that y'all don't want me to skip them and I won't skip them. Uh, but like I said, I just don't really like the uh, speeches in this game. So, sorry Takeda, I don't need you to be doing that right now. So, we'll go ahead and set up our guys in loose form. Loose stool form. Putting our guys right there. Alright, so pretty standard formation. We'll march on forward just like that. Alright. One thing I really love about Shogun is the mechanics and the controls. I really love them. Um, it's probably one of the things that this game actually got right was the controls and mechanics. Uh, one thing I really like is that uh, the horse mechanics are spot on on this game. You know, if you charge a unit into, uh, I don't know, these um, Yari, uh, Yari Ashgrove, or Yari Ashgrove, Ash, Ash, Ashgro oh, whatever. If you charge them into these Yaris, um, and you tell them to get back, they'll get back, but, um, you know, uh, if you were to go into Napoleon, good luck trying to get your, try, good luck trying to save your cab. And I know that cab isn't supposed to be a big important thing in Napoleon, but it's still something I would like to, you know, keep alive for a couple minutes. <laughs> so, let's go ahead and get our bows up and going. Alright. Alright, so you guys are gonna try and charge into my guys. Let's charge our Yaris into these other Yaris here. And then if we're lucky, I can hit him from behind with my cab. Help him out a little bit. Yeah, so let's hit him from behind. Hopefully I don't hurt too much of my own guys. Yeah, these guys are already routing. Perfect. Uh, 
Um, if I get a good shot at the enemy general, I'm going to try and take it. Every time I fight a match, I try to kill the general as quick as possible. Uh, because that way he doesn't have to, he doesn't come back and haunt me. So they're taking out their Yaris. And they're going to start fighting me, so that's good. I have a straight shot toward the enemy general, so let's do it. While they're distracted. Alright, there goes our cab. There we go. Come on, guys. You got this. Take him out. Alright, so they're gone. My lord! A glorious victory will soon be yours! Come on, kill the general. Kill the general. That's all I need you guys to do. Kill the general. General, but that's alright. So we're in the battle here. To be honest, I actually thought I was gonna lose that battle because I haven't really um, accustomed myself to the game's mechanics too much. And not only that, this game kind of does give the AI a clutch um, uh, when you put it on hard difficulty so slice this guy in half all right so we got dreaded force that's good let's go ahead and try and bring our guy back um so i don't really have um or diplomacy i want to see if we can trade with um a few people here the hojo we're already trading with you, the Emigua. Let's trade with you guys. See what you guys got. Greetings. Uh, the Kizo, I do want to trade with you guys. I want to trade with everybody on this Welcome. map, so, on this list. So. Alright. Alright, so here I'm going to end the turn. like I said, I think it's going to be a little bit hard to keep our provinces from being attacked frequently. Because, <laughs> like I said, we're basically sandwiched between a bunch of, um, uh, alright, we're already researching up to form, so that's pretty good. Um, but like I said, we're kind of, uh, in the middle of everything here. So there's nothing to really protect us if we come under attack from, um, uh, uh, an enemy. So... I think I want more bows than I do uh, Yaris at this point. Yeah, so. So, I'm, I'm just going to basically spend the rest of my turns building up my army. Um, Consider my words with care, Hojo, and likewise military your response. Alliance. Um, I don't know. Yeah, I guess I'll take it. So securing shenanigans. Let's put an end to their shenanigans once and for all. All right. So they want us to take north. Um, Shouldn't know. So, like I said, I want to just try and build my army so I can take it. Um, and I think we might be able to take it if we make it to um, uh, spring. If not, then that's okay. Like I said, we're going to be spending most of the time building our army up. Because I do not want to be... I want to have a good, healthy army. It's better to be safe than sorry, because I don't know what they have stationed over there. So, I don't want to bring a small army of... Whoa, what was that? 
Ideal for whittling down. I saw some guys moving. Okay, so it's these guys. If I might just auto resolve this battle, I think we might have a chance at winning it. If we auto resolve, so. So I just auto resolve that. I am gonna lose a good amount of my guys, though. I already know. But he's gone. It looks like our guy's upgraded, so that's good. I get back over there. I don't want you to suffer attrition too much. Alright. So like I said, I want to try and get this attack done by the end of winter, or at least on the start of uh, spring. So we can kind of get our bearings over there. I just hope nobody captures it before. Because like I said, I do know that there are other clans around it, so... Alright, so I think we're good enough here. Let's go ahead and upgrade our guy. Koi Carp. Diplomatic Relations. I'll take the Diplomatic Relations, actually. And I like to be a little bit sparing with these, so I'm going to go ahead and just upgrade all of them. Alright, so perfect. And not too much over there, so it looks like we might just need to auto-resolve, so that'll be nice. I would fight it if there were more guys there, but there's not really that much guys over there, so there's no point in wasting my time. So we'll research more guys to protect uh, Kai here. And depending on time, this might be a short episode, guys. Um, I don't know. It's almost 1 o'clock in the morning here, so I need to kind of get it going. So, uh, all right, so we're finally studying form, so that's good. Uh, a lot of our trade has been disrupted. So... We're going to go ahead and march on these guys. And then I'm going to just go ahead and siege, siege them up a little bit. If they decide to attack me, then that's alright. I'm glad I beat Kizo here because I knew they were about to take that town. So I'm glad they didn't do that. So, let's see. horse breeders, plus three charge bonus for cavalry recruit in this province, or horse stronghold. Let's go ahead and get stronghold. So, and the time. They might just end up just getting starved out. Honestly, I don't think they'll want to fight me, and if they do, uh, they'll probably just lose. Or I might just need to fight him right now, cause, cause, uh, Kizo's getting pretty arrogant here. So I think I'll just attack him. So I'll just auto resolve it. So peacefully occupy. That's nice, actually. <laughs> I was able to use his reinforce uh, reinforcements. So, all right. So we capture this area. That's good. So Takeda plus one more out for your units under his command. So that's good. Um, let's go ahead and get horse breeders. So end the turn. I just hope that Kizo isn't getting butt hurt <laughs> and they just decide to attack me out of nowhere. I 
I do know there's a clan that literally only has one province, and I think it's this one right here. Um, if I can take that, then that'll be good. It'll just be another province for me to have, so. Um, to get his brother, I'm going to go ahead and send him on back to Kai. I need a leader over there. So, we'll pick you up. Oh, I thought we could pick you up, but I guess not. Alright. So, on the turn. City over there. Um, I do want to upgrade to stronghold here just so I can get that extra fireball, katana samurai. I'm kind of okay with what I have here. Uh, right now, what I need is something to get good money. Plus 100 wealth from commerce in this province. Yeah, we'll get that. Plus, I can make some samurais, and I think I might be able to build them over there, too. So, um, finance. Master of the Arts. Form is almost done. So close to form. Alright, so I'm going to pretty much kind of, like, take it easy uh, <laughs> for the first, uh, few turns, about 10 turns, I'm going to take it kind of easy, um, uh, only because I don't want to spread out too fast, uh, because obviously I don't really have the army to do it, and I don't have the funds to do it either at the moment, so, uh, I'm going to just kind of take it easy a little bit, upgrade my towns up and do the best I can, and then hopefully, um, what I might do is I might try and take some provinces up here. Uh, maybe this one, the uh, Ichigo province, or like I said, the Hida one. Uh, but the one that I really do want to try and take is the Hojo one. Uh, because they have a gold mine uh, in the area, which will be spectacular for me to take. Uh, for keeping, safekeeping, I guess. Um... Uh, so I can just go ahead and start getting some more gold, and then I can finance my warmongering. Use their people as slaves. Alright. So, like I said, guys, I'm sorry if there's not too much action going on right now, but give me some, give me some little bit of a slack. Uh, this is the first episode, and like I said, um, I just need to start getting uh, everything up and going again. Because these guys, I can already tell, weren't really in a good way uh, when we took them over, so or when we uh, took over their command or whatever from them. So, so I'm gonna go ahead and get another one of these Yari Samurais. These guys have done pretty well in battle, so I'm going to go ahead and grab them. Um, another army. Don't want to hire a ninja over there. Well, you know what? Oops. I will hire a ninja. I'm going to hire a ninja here so we can start scouting the areas around here. And then I'm going to try and build um, another ninja training thing, whatever, so I can start scouting around here, too. So... To be honest, I think Shogun is probably the most beautiful Total War game they've ever made. Um, a, com a competitor would probably be uh, Attila or Rome, but I honestly think that this one kind of takes it. So, I don't know if I want to do that mission. Um, just depends. 
Uh, Takeda, Light Cav. I can already recruit Light Cav. Uh, oops. Yeah, I can already, I can already get Light Cav from over here. Um, like I said, I just need something to get some money, so just do the sake then. Yari Samurai doing well. So, so it'll take two turns to be done, and then I'll get my Samurai. So I'm just going to go ahead and speed through those two turns to finish it. Because I really do want my Samurai so I can just scout ahead. See what's going on. So, the Unlike only like that. the only question here is which way I want to go. I can go down this way. I can go down that way. I can go down this way. But it looks like I'm gonna go down this way. Um, it does seem like uh, Hojo isn't really. Yeah, it doesn't seem like Hojo owns a lot of provinces at the moment. Yeah, so they only have these these three. So if I kind of like work up the nerve to get them, it should be fairly easy considering um, they have almost no army uh, defending. So I just pretty much need to destroy this army here, and then we're done. They're done. Uh, but I need to do that relatively quick so they don't start uh, building up armies. Um, like I said, I know there's a province there that I can take. Looks like we got four now, um, so I need to. Whoops! I need to see what I want to get now. Um, I'm gonna just start looking up way of chi because uh, that's what I really need. That's what I really want. And plus, I need my ninja, so we'll get my ninja. So, like I said, we'll just go ahead and um, uh, move on in through. Uh, oops, I didn't mean to go through that way, but it will. So like I said, we'll just uh, take that province over there, and then we'll go on down and try and take Hojo. Uh, but like I said, I just don't want to overextend myself uh, too much, because I have done that a few times before. Um, horse Cav, I'm going to have you guys wait there, because I know I'm going to send an army, to, an army down there to hey, help you out a little bit. So here's our ninja. Let's go ahead and take him over there. Yeah, so there's the Hida. Like I said, it doesn't seem like they're... Um, it doesn't seem like they have an army at all. And not only that, it seems like this is the perfect staging area to take. Plus they have lumber. So I'm going to go ahead and take it. So we'll take our ca uh, light cav. I don't even think they have an army station over there, but sometimes right. travelers. So they have two provinces. That's all right. I don't expect them to really fight back much. So can auto resolve that. Peacefully occupy. And then I'll, I'll exempt that area from tax. So, that should help them out. There we go. Of course, I won't forget, though. So, this is perfect. We have lumber now, so uh, that'll be good. So, this area here is their last... Um, 
province or area here, so that'll be good. We can take that one next. Uh, of course, I do need my I do need my ninja to uh, scout ahead for me before I do anything drastic. So it's just nice to spread out <laughs> a little bit. We also get that lumber, like I said, so that should uh, kind of help us out when we start making getting harbors. So we have Zen now. Um, what are we researching now? Zen. Gardeners built. Buddhist temple. Plus one to clan ride happiness. I want to get this one actually next. So, so Ninja, you go over there. Like I said, I need you to make sure that there's nothing I'm going to be walking into that's a trap. Oh yeah, these guys are done. <laughs> They're done. Let's see if I can... I'm, I don't know if I'll be able to pull it off. I'm, um, let's just take a look. I'm just going to go ahead and watch that. I think he might actually fail. Oh yeah, here we go. I just hope he was able to escape. Nope. Oh, okay, thank God. Alright, well. That's alright. At least I didn't lose our guy there, so. I think we're going to go ahead and make... Uh, sawmill. Um, we're gonna bring Takeda. I don't want to overdo it with infantry, so we're gonna go ahead and go over there and we're gonna fight him. And I am going to take a little bit of casualties from attrition, but that's alright. And that's perfect. We can make katana and bow samurai here, so that's good too. All right. Okay. Uh, I don't want to make a gambling area. Uh, diplomacy. Who are your enemies? Yeah, you're gonna want to trade with me. Sometimes. Sataki. You guys want to trade with me? I'm not going to trade with you guys. So wait. Well, let's see. 122, 112. But your enemies are way more than the Sataki. So I'll just have a thing with the Sataki. All right. So we should have a good amount of money uh, to spend. So on the turn... This is good. I didn't think we'd be able to... <coughs> excuse me. Wow, excuse me. <clears throat> um, I didn't think we'd be able to spread out as much as, as this. So. Ah, uh, that's alright. So they have bow samurai and all that shit. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and just siege them a little bit. So we'll continue the siege. Ninja. Uh, ninja can't do much. So I guess you can just go ahead and scout ahead some more. What about the other samurai? Where is he? There he is. Well, I guess we'll be this year. Okay, these guys, on the other hand, look like they're ready to go to war. So 
So, go in the turn. Hopefully they'll attack me, because that's what I wanted to do. I think actually what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and just pull them back and make a kind of a bigger force break the siege. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and move our guys over there. I'm going to take some forces and I'll put them in over there. So guys, I think this is going to be it for today. Um, um, so just wanted to let you guys know that this campaign should be up on Tuesday or Wednesday. Uh, just go ahead and stay and by for that. Uh, one thing I would like to mention is I did get Total War Warhammer. I pre-ordered it. Uh, I don't know yet if I'm going to be making videos on it on the day of release. Only because uh, I need to see if... I need to adjust settings, I need to do all that kind of stuff, um, so uh, maybe on the day of release I might do it, I don't know, I do know a few other people um, have pre-ordered it, so I might play with them or not, uh, we might just do a little bit of a multiplayer or uh, release special or something like that, uh, but anyway guys, I uh, hope you enjoyed the first episode of our Total War Shogun to uh, Rise of the Samurai campaign, um, so anyway. Like I said before, this is Total War Master, signing off.